I'm a little nervous. We'll see. I feel good. I feel good. Hold up. Let me explain. I race the T-Rex so you don't have to. But before I could take on my theoretical demons, I had to talk to a theoretical expert. So, you've come to the right place. Time, Time to, to science. science. There's still no real consensus on the top running speed of a T-Rex. Ah! The most recent study into this was done by William Sellers at the University of Manchester. He and his group looked at the amount of weight stress that T-Rex leg bones could handle, and from this they calculated that its speed would top out at around 12 miles per hour. Other studies put that number closer to around 15 miles per hour. 15 miles per hour. Right, so in the original Jurassic Park, the T-Rex chases the Jeep down the dirt road for about 45 seconds, covering a distance of around a quarter of a mile. So that would be a speed of 20 miles per hour. Carry the two, yeah, and that's way too fast. Right. But what we can do is slow her mm -hmm. down a bit. Mm -hmm. To 15 miles an hour. And so what you're saying is that for me to be able to beat a T-Rex in a race, I would have to cover the distance of an entire standard racetrack in no more than 60 seconds. Yes. Challenge accepted. Oh boy, I better start training. Tenderfoot MD. I won the Newark, New Jersey Olympics in 1984. 400 meter dash in 10 seconds. If you want to be the T-Rex, you can't be in the gym. You got to get in the streets. You got to get in the streets. It's an apex predator right here. It's going to be chasing you. Ain't good enough. Ain't good enough. Ain't going to get it. Go get eight. Go get eight. Okay, he's got a little sugar in the Kool-Aid, okay. That's 80%. 80 plus 20, that's 100. Gotta get to 100. You better get faster. Better move your feet. You wanna get caught? You wanna get eight? You gotta have strong arms. T-Rex has weak arms. You gotta have strong arms. A sex machine. Damn! <laughs> yeah! I think we got it. Can I coach or not? Tenderfoot! I'm a little nervous. We'll see. I feel good. I feel good. Must go faster. Like, like, 
after a game when they immediately interview someone, they're like, I can't talk right now. You literally can't talk right now. It's true. I'm proud of this it's man true. for what he's achieved today. He had the blood, the sweat, the tears, and the sacrifice. Ooh, wait, hold on. Speed found a way. But listen, I told people that dinosaurs are not just in your mind, they're also in your gallbladder. What he's trying to say is like, you gotta fight your internal demons, as well as the external ones, man. It's, it's a two-headed fight. Where's my son? <laughs> this is the thirstiest shit I've ever done. Thirsty for science, right? Running, oh Ooh. shit. Filming some behind the scenes. Well, I just, yeah, this is just for the end card. <laughs> you can put other videos here. Swipe right here. up to see more content. Be sure to like and subscribe. Yep, below, here we go. Uh, remember to follow the Dinosaur Whisperer for future thirsty Instagram lives. <laughs> or if you don't want that much thirstiness, you can follow Nessie Hill at yeah, Nessie Hill. Yeah, my pictures are quite conservative and today I'm just looking for 10 new followers. Right, you can also follow, new followers. you can also follow Zach, me. It's really easy. Six Z's and an AK. <laughs> Very easy. <laughs> and cut. It's just gonna go right in. And uh huh. And oh my gosh, look at that science. Dustin, pick up that science. And drink that science. Drink that science. <laughs> There's a mug. I gave you a mug. It's so frothy. <laughs> like it just fills everything. It's kind of good though. <laughs>